he must step down and he must still be impeached. Um, stepping down does not mean uh, he must not be impeached. And even after the, even during the impeachment, he must still be arrested. He committed crime. Uh, he committed corruption. So all of that must follow. And then why should it follow? It must even follow more because Ramaphosa is fighting as if he has not done anything wrong. If he was someone who was showing remorse, uh, perhaps some of these things will look the other way and say, no, uh, the guy has seen his mistakes and he has accepted. No, he's not. As the EFF were very happy that the secret ballot is not provided. Nkosazana spoke on TV and said Cyril must go. Lindy Wesisulu spoke on TV and said Cyril must go. Uh, Supra spoke and said Cyril must go. Tomorrow, let them go and raise their hands. They must not become peacetime heroes. They were talking on TV. Let the real truth prevail tomorrow. The ANC, if it votes against the panel's recommendation tomorrow, it will be showing the Constitution a middle finger. It's as simple as that. And uh, the party that has always claimed that it came with the best constitution in the world, uh, the party that is led by a person who claims to have been a drafter of the same constitution. Uh, so uh, uh, um, um, it will be very clear tomorrow that if the decisions do not favor them, they disregard the constitution. Uh, and they only love the constitution if the decision favors them. The army has got the responsibility to protect the constitution. If the political leadership is found wanting and is acting against the constitution, they've got the entire responsibility to defend it. They have a responsibility to defend the country. A man went a wall for four days. The, the, what, what more do you want? We were leaderless. And uh, one such vacuum uh, arises. We're going to be led by facts. We'll just have a gangster who's going to call a press conference at the SABC and say, we're done. We're, I'm in charge now. No work tomorrow. There's nothing wrong with DD. And as a result, just be ready. Tighten your seat belt. It's unavoidable. We are likely to eat beetroots Christmas Day with DD as a president. As you are having your seven colors, DD will be delivering a Christmas message. So this scaremongering will not work because there are no facts, none whatsoever, against DD.